keep me wondering Is our love strong Just like a love song Baby, it's haunting me Don't know what you're thinking It's like I'm sinking Deep underwater This morning, we got in to do some chores and try to finish that um, storage we're building for the hay and grain for the goats and uh, we realized that there was something wrong with Rocky. He's a pretty chill guy. I've showed you in other videos and I'll have them linked down below where I introduce you to the herd. But since he was born, he reminds me of his mom, Kalani, who is the doe from Hanson Neverdone Farms where I got them. And he really... <laughs> Hi girls. Hi mama. Are you exploring? So anyways, we went in and I realized that the same thing that happened to Duke was happening to Rocky. Now, Rocky has gained a lot of weight since he's, you know, been with us. The problem is with Rocky is that he is free range, well, not free ranging, but he is in pasture. So he's eating weeds, he's eating, you know, ferns and trees and, you know, all kinds of things and really he was not used to that um, so I think it's been an adjustment for him to be able to say no to food but this is what happens when you overeat at least for him so what we decided to do was wash all his butt he had poop everywhere like i'm telling you uh, behind the neck in his ear his butt i don't know if he was rubbing himself against it i don't know what the deal is but i decided that i was just gonna do the same that i did with duke um, i'm gonna make sure he doesn't get anything else to eat but hay which is going to be hard. I'm gonna have to be on top of it and uh, just keep an eye on them. And we're monitoring him. We're trying to make sure that he is hungry, that he is thirsty and that he is moving. Um, this far today, Sunday, we've noticed that he is eating and he is drinking and he's active for how, you know, quiet and how, um, mellow he is so he is moving around but we just have to keep an eye on it make sure that he doesn't have any more diarrhea and we'll go from there I've heard it both ways just give it a couple of days and ex you know just check his poop and make sure that he's going to poop normal and there are some other people that say you know what just start treating it with something just in case it's coccidiosis or something like that that you know we might not be able to find the perfect medicine for him in time so it's kind of a tricky thing to make a decision I think I've decided that I'm gonna try to watch him for a couple of days and feed him just hay, make sure he doesn't find anything else. I give the goats treats, like I'll get lettuce and I'll get or beets or carrot tops and stuff. So I'm gonna try to make sure that he doesn't get anything of that, any of that, and we'll see what happens. But it's kind of hard to monitor them really as far as food when they are living in the woods and they have things that they can eat um, but I'll keep you guys updated this far I think he's gonna be okay Mama la guajo where I'm going? to the water you guys wanna take a shower? didn't think so, didn't think so The ducks are trying to, uh, they think that they're, they're going to have ducklings. So they've been taking turns to watch over the eggs. But uh, right now, both of them came to the creek. It seems like it's a gathering place. I'm going to get some water and grab some. Try to fill this up. Hope is like a force of nature.
a force of nature. Again. And then I'm going to try to fill this up mostly for the garden and also for the ducks if we need them so we don't have to use really clean water. Yes, and also it's training today with the goats. Panzota que tenés, Te quiere comer, dice que estás delicioso. ¡Delicioso! Girls. You want lettuce? There you go. Oh, they're very yummy. Come here, Annabelle. Come here. Woohoo! Lettuce for young lady. These are some raspberries that I got from a neighbor and a friend. I have some that I planted to kind of make a hedge and at the same time get raspberries. These are blackberries. Um, I got them yesterday. I just need to transplant them, put them in a final spot. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do.
So I put this so they can climb or lean on something. And as they grow, they can go to the second one.